Okay, I'm finally gonna do it. I'm gonna open up the party wagon. Hey guys, it's Big Manila here once again, and this time I'm gonna open the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles party wagon. I know it's been a while, as always, I guess uh, I am a new in box collector also, so sometimes it's hard for me to open these figures because I do like them how they are in the box still and keep their value. But, uh, you know, the turtle van is something like a dream come true for me. I never had this one as a kid, always hard to find, and Finally, I got the classic collection back in, I think it's 2010. But anyway, let's check in the back of the box when this one was made. Alrighty, let's check around the box to see the date. See underneath. Okay, so. This one you can see back, this was back in, this is 2013. So yeah, so. Right now it's 2020 and it's been a while, so yeah, it's uh, I guess it's time to finally open it and get my turtles to get actual turtle van. And then around the box here, you can see it has all the descriptions of what the turtle van comes with here. Has your little a story. Let's see what it says here. Congratulations, <laughs> congratulations. You are now a proud owner of the most advanced party vehicle ever designed. The radical, super cool, super <laughs> spoiler trigger the foot-pounding tenderizer, Michelangelo loves to ride the shotgun on the swinging foot tenderizer side arm while Raphael wields the wheel and I'll say wheel all the control <laughs> this control is now in the palm of your foot busting hands. Alrighty. Yep, finally got in my hands. But anyway, it shows everything it comes with here. Just a quick thing, let's see what it has here. Shows here the super spoiler. Turtle plated uh, flip top, a foot uh, finder radar blaster, dual CB antenna machine gun, uh, shell proof armored windshield visor, uh, back attack side mirrors, right. uh, turtle sewer light, um, street level bomb slide, uh, turtle shell hubcaps, and radical racing radials. And here it's a spring action foot tenderizer. Tenderizer uh, holds one finger. Uh, I know in the cartoon they used to originally have a like a gun there or thing, but they don't put that <laughs> there anymore. Uh, that kind of sucks. So I wish it came with, come with that. But so on the side here it also shows what the turtle van can do. Top come out. It says uh, pull back the super spoiler to automatically release the spring uh, action foot tenderizer. Wacko bombs and other party surprises. Oh, this is actually getting me excited. It's actually reminding me of a kid uh, buying some Ninja Turtle toys or getting to some presents. And I don't know, these uh, figures are really awesome and exciting. But alrighty, and here it shows a uh, turtle plated flip top allows easy access for six figures, even more if you squish them. And here it shows a uh, shell proof armored windshield visor pulled down to protect our heroes. Remove the foot finder radar to reveal the anti foot blasters. Alrighty. Well, okay. That actually is a main cannon right there. And the top here, almost the same as the back, but no description. Shows all the turtles there. And in the bottom, which I showed earlier, more things you could get at this uh, Classic Collections line back in 2013. I kind of wish I had those robots on, but whatever. And here, what it shows, yeah, just same on the side, uh, I mean, on the back or top. And of course, it has a little story. I guess you guys could pause it if you want to take a closer look at it, but it's the same story they have in all the Ninja Turtle packages back then. Let's see if we can take a quick photo of that and uh, yeah, well, let's show it on my blog. Anyway. Let's uh, start to open up the party wagon. Whew, okay, all right, I'm a little nervous. I don't know why I'm a little nervous, because I guess, I don't know, it's hard for me to open new packages sometimes. 
especially when uh, I'm also a Mint and Box collector, but I gotta play with this party wagon. I had another one of this, I bought two of them at the same time, but I did sell the other one. And yeah, then time to open this one. Kinda wish I didn't sell it, but I did sell it for, I don't know, good amount of money, <laughs> which is way, way more than I bought it for. But anyway, that's another story. So this time I'm gonna be use, uh, using this multi-tool to open up this package. Well, if you want any of these things, like hopefully I could find uh, this turtle van, hopefully on Amazon still. I'll put a link if I could find it, and I'll put it down in the description. Also, I'll put a description where you can find this multi-tool I just got. Always need a multi-tool, and this one seems really good so far, then let's see how it works with opening the turtle van. Alrighty, Whew. let's open her up. There it is. Taking it slowly out, and there we go. First time in so many years, it's coming out. Oh, so far, this thing looks very beautiful. Okay, look at all this stuff here. Okay, so far here's one of the plastic uh, protection or packaging protection or whatever something for the packaging. But uh, <laughs> yeah, there's a visor, and I'll put this on the side. And here we go. And here are all the other accessories from the side mirrors, blasters, and bombs. In right there, all nicely packed in there. And the plastic, um, yeah, plastic packaging. All right, here is the van at a quick glance. Oh, nice. Sticker's kind of peeling off there, but whatever. Just press it down more. Oh, I guess over time, uh, being in storage, never taking it out. I just hope they'll stick in there, but I wonder if there's any, uh, like, I could get from toy hacks if these ever fall out to get them again, but so far they're okay. Hopefully I do not have to replace them. But yeah, there we go. And I'm gonna open this one here. Oh, I see the first time it opens. There's no spoiler, but here we go. Boom! The trap door comes out. Put a figure there, I guess. There's a rubber band or a seatbelt thing you could put in there. Oh wow, this is beautiful. Like a big kit, and here is uh, what it comes in the package. There, all right, nothing else in there. I'll just close it quickly and see if that is from the Nickelodeon Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, which I do love. I guess there's a promo for them. Oh, there's a seatbelt right there, and I'm just gonna open this package ever so easily with my new utility knife or utility tool. All right, I guess it comes yeah, with two rubber bands because meh, we'll see what the instruction says what to use with uh, using for, but so far I'm getting the seat belts for the side there. And also here has a little checklist for the uh, Nickelodeon Ninja Turtles, which I do have most of them if you see my other videos. Um, I, you know what, I even might even open Shredder next. Destructor Shredder. But anyway, these are the figures. I still haven't seen the whole series because I don't have them. I don't have anywhere to watch them from streaming sites, and I don't want to subscribe to another streaming channel to watch them. But hopefully someday I can finish the whole series. And this here is just the instructions how to put everything together. And you know what? There are no stickers. I could for the bombs. I don't know where those went. See my bombs here? They didn't come with stickers. Okay, I think it usually says what 
something bomb or something like that. Mm -hmm. But I guess uh, these ones don't have it, so I guess I may have to go to Toy Hacks and get some stickers, but... Anyway, these will do for now. And just open this in a quick glance. This is where the bombs go, right there. I'll put that there. Put the slider open. Is that open? Right, there we go. There, I guess this little hook keeps it, everything in place. Right there, but anyway, boom! Open it again, spring loaded. You can see the van, the seating in there. And they said six figures, and you put uh, other digital figures in there. Honestly, I only remember uh, people on Neil driving this vehicle while the others, other turtles bought into action. But anyway, all right, let's see if I could put all the accessories on the turtle van. Okay, so let me just put this here ever so carefully back. There we go. Um, what's that there? Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take out the bombs. These bombs actually remind me of the uh, they on the turtle blimp. They're the same things because uh, these things go on the side of the turtle blimp, and when you press a the trigger, these will fall down. Well, maybe I should take on my turtle blimp, but right now I'm a little tight for room. Yeah, it shows here. The elastic band are put it for the figures there. Feels like I'm sweeping up uh, a car here. You know, all the accessories on. And there goes the bomb. That's a little scary. Looks like it has a little stress marks on there. Okay, I put the turtle van all together, best of my knowledge. Let's see what it has here. So you can see I put on the blasters, the side uh, uh, side rear view mirrors, there's an antenna on top of here, and the visor is spoilers also on there and here, of course, when you open it, boom, bombs come out. Oh, well, not that well. I thought both of them would come out, but both of them don't really fit in there at the same time if you put it right in there. Both of them do fit in there, but I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm doing it wrong or not, but it doesn't seem... Oh, there you go. Now it works. Well, it wasn't working for me before, but let's do that again. Take part two. Anyway, boom! Bombs come out. <laughs> okay, now that's pretty cool. The only thing that's get, uh, will get a little bit annoying every time you open this up and you want to put the figures in. But too bad there's no uh, locking thing where when you open it, these won't come out. Here we go, put the bombs back in there. Also to take, put down the, the visor. There you go, and you take out to the antenna and it becomes the foot cannon right there, and also a shield for the turtles. All in all, a great vehicle. There's one thing on the instructions I do not understand. And here it shows, here it has a, if everyone, anybody knows, goes here. Lastly, close the front visor open with the windshield, and I don't want to, that is a, an F off an R. Can't seem to find that. If anybody knows, let me know in the comments. Alrighty, so I'll just put this back here. Overall look at the vehicles. It looks uh, really, really nice here. Has a little uh, foot tenderizer here. If you open it, boom. All right, hit the foot soldiers or any other enemies of the turtles. Yeah, I wish this could lock here by itself. Or anything. All right, there it closes. Nice windshields here on the side. Foot stinks on the labels. Uh, I like the wheels here. They're just like looks like little turtle shells. And the tires, nice and smooth. This thing rolls pretty nice. Back here shows the engine. 
three more windows. One thing I would like either they would be, I would like if those were just cut open too, or just solid like turtle shell. But anyway, here the sticker here, slam! It's par <laughs> party time. <laughs> kind of reminds me of Batman. Things in there. Uh, what? Little pop up bubbles for like from we were watching the Batman series before. Again, the foot stinks. And up front here, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with the. <laughs> you can see the bump here, here. And Turtles bumper with the teeth. Oh, oh well. Uh, maybe I should have bought another one in here and then see if there's any other toy hack stickers to make it look. Uh, well, it's more realistic somehow. But I'll check it out. Maybe I'll even buy another van. Maybe. <laughs> It's a little bit, uh, a little bit costly and does take a lot of room. But underneath here, there you go. There's uh, what it looks like underneath the van. The van it doesn't really. Oh, it does say the date there. Couldn't see that earlier, but anyway, ever so easily. Let me try not to pop anything out. It says here. I'm not sure if you can see it. Uh, on the bottom, it says. Viacom International 2013 copyright uh, and yeah by Playmate Toys Incorporated and yeah made in China El Segundo California AST94170 I don't know what that means but anyway there it is but finally yes I do have a turtle van and I'll put this. Oh, there we go. Here, I guess, also, if you want, you could also put his, um, oops, <laughs> his blasters at the top of here. You can see that on top. On the same on the side here, pop it here. Antennas, or something like that. I guess so it doesn't look like such a military vehicle, or it's so dangerous. I mean, and you put these back up. There you go. It doesn't look so much like a battle vehicle, so they could go in disguise, I guess. Just a nice thing you could do. But for me, I'll probably just leave these down the whole time. We'll see, maybe. Just for display. Also, when I play. There we go. <sighs> All right, let's put some turtles in this vehicle. All right, so let's open up. And of course, Michelangelo's already there with his Gatling guns. <laughs> or uh, improvised Gatling guns I made for him. And uh, I got April O'Neil here. For me, I always notice she's the driver. I remember from that first episode. So I'll put her here in the driver's seat. Okay, and then got Donatello. I think he's usually here inside. They fit pretty cool. And here's Leonardo, ready to slash and cut all the foot soldiers right there. Hey, right, and getting their bombs ready. Actually, I'm pretty getting pretty excited for this. This looks pretty cool. And for us, us here. And for this here, I got Raphael. Put him in uh, shotgun right there with April. And there we go, kind of, sort of, maybe. All right, there's all the turtles in the van. Hopefully I get more shots. I'll, I'll probably get more shots of these on my blog. But let me see here, it's turning to this side. There they are, so what? Somewhat, sort of, kind of, maybe. There, see, there's Michelangelo right in there, too. And Leonardo, Raphael, April in the driver's seat, and Donatello taking care of the computer stuff. Alrighty, well, that's what I got so far, and let's see, we have one more figure to put in there. Of course you can't fit in, but here it is just for size comparison. Ugh, this big Manila 
right in the background. Right there behind Michelangelo. Okay, and we'll just put this back down here. Oh, that looks better with the van and everybody in it. But anyway, there we go. So I did make my improvised cannons here for Michelangelo. And oops, sorry about that. And everyone's there. This looks pretty cool. Um, and I hope to get more shots and pictures of this turtle van onto my blog and on Instagram. So I have uh, other um, social media channels that you can check out. Put the links down below. And if you ever feel like um, supporting the channel, there's also a Patreon. And also, if you just check out my links down below in the description, that will help my uh, channel grow a lot. And uh, thanks guys for watching. And I hope you did like uh, my opening of the Classic Collections uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Turtle Van. And uh, thanks guys for checking out, out my channel. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Alright, till the next video. See you guys soon.